Please welcome to my channel. So today we are here at MacArthur Park. Now, this park was named after General Douglas MacArthur. He was a very important general, but yet very controversial figure in American military history. So this park was famous not in a good way back in the 80s for prostitution, violence, and drug dealings. Homicides was also out of control. It is now overrun by drug users. So this park was designed specifically for friends and families and their children just to come here and chill and have barbecues, but not anymore. So the sad part is I haven't seen children in this park. So 95% of people in this park are the homeless, the drug users, and the mentally ill people. So when I first started my channel, I used to make videos like this just to spread awareness about what's going on in your neighborhood. So people will attack me and ask me, why are you showing us videos like this? Why should we care? They asked me. So my answer was, so you know and understand. So you, the people, in the future, you can elect better government officials who cares about their neighborhoods. Did you know that health department comes here multiple times a week to give away needles? Yes, boxes of needles and syringes. So he called them clean needles. And there were so many people all waiting in line. So he asked me if I would like to have some. And I said no. Right here, exactly the same spot where this nun lady is parked at. They can't possibly expect these people to stop using drugs when they constantly keep offering them all the necessary supplies for their drug use. So if you can, please try to help these people. We are all people and we're all in this together. At least by showing them that you care will give them hope. Hope that they still have a chance in life a chance to change and be productive members of society. Please give this video a like and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you. Oh, How you doing? Yeah, time. Yeah, shit. Man, do you, do you need something? Uh -huh. Are you good? Okay. What can possibly causing these homeless people's feet to swell up like this? So one of the homeless guys told me not to call the police or 911 in this park because I can easily be targeted by the drug dealers. That's why these guys are doing their own CPR or using their own techniques to revive this guy. Oh 
So these are some of his friends who are distancing themselves from the situation. Did you see that? They just look at him and just keep going like they don't really care. Do you guys need anything? Huh? Do you guys need anything to help out? Do you need anything? Uh, water. Water is great. Oh. I grab some water. Yeah, that would help. All right. I have some water. Yeah, thank yeah. you very much. Yeah, sure. Yes. You okay now, man? Uh, oh, I was scared for a moment. <laughs> Yo. Yeah. yeah, man. I believe all of us can be affected in so many ways. If these people don't get the proper help that they need, there will be so many unprovoked attacks just so they can get a fix. So the homeless with mental illness tend to get paranoid. They can be a danger to themselves or to the general population. Means you or your loved ones on the streets. So the park is very dangerous. There are so many robberies in this park. So a theft in a neighborhood is really out of control. I also lost my bicycle. Hello. I lost a bike. So, yeah. Huh? Yeah, I lost one, dude. I'm just, all I had is a seat. So, hopefully, I can find it. You know what I'm saying? What's your name? I'm Henry. Nice to meet you. I'm Chloe. Sam? Chloe. Chloe. Nice to meet you. Henry. Uh, this is Lacey. Lacey, what's up, bro? Good, you good? Uh, yeah? Good. Yeah. Maybe you might want to like drink some water before it's like getting really hot. Because you might get dehydrated. Yeah. That would be so good. It will cool you off. Yeah. You know the water? You need to get for muscles and your body. Really? For different meals and vitamins. Yeah. It's been so cold last night. Oh, morning, so. really? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. But he's drink, drinking a lot? Yeah, he had a big day of PD light, too. Oh, okay. Yeah. Gatorade has one, too. It's called that. Um, that's the top baby, the Gatorade one. Gatorade, Gatorade. That's power, yeah. Light. Gatorade. Yeah, yeah. It helps with the muscles or something, so sure. It's Gatorade electrolyte. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's true. That's true. Yeah. Come on, baby, let's go. Nice to meet you guys. Yeah, you want some help getting up or are you good? He's not getting up. Oh, he's not? Okay. Yeah, I hope you're okay, bro. Yeah. Yeah. I think it's lying down like by the, um, you know, like a shade. It's to be better for you. And you too, lady. <laughs> okay, guys, bye. Nice to meet you, by the way. Yeah. Hold on. I lost a bike, huh? <laughs> What's up, man? Are you good? Yeah. 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 Looking for my bike. So. Lost one. Where's your bike at? Lost it. Is that a jacket? Huh? Is that a jacket? Yeah. What does it look like? It's a gray. Like. Oh, gray? Like gray, like like this jacket. Oh, gray. 
the color. Yeah, yeah. Do you want a light? I think you should to move to the uh, to the shade. See what I mean? You need a shade. It's hot. Oh, you do? Oh, okay. I'm gonna say if you move like to somewhere where it's like this shape. Yeah. Yeah. But all right, man. I oh, mean. Give this video a thumbs up. I will appreciate it. Thank you. Like I said, this park is huge. I'm on my way to the other part of this park. So I once met a lady who is one of my viewers who told me about her traumatic experience. She told me how she got pepper sprayed by a homeless guy out of nowhere an unprovoked attack and she's never been the same ever since she said that she will never set foot in downtown Denver and it's been years since the incident happened and it wasn't a robbery she believed that the guy has a mental illness Now, this is the amount of trash that the city pick up every single day, just in this area alone. And by the end of the day, there's trash all over the park again. If you know who she is or recognize her, help her to get off the streets because these women get taken advantage of or get violated by these men on the streets. They are so vulnerable, especially when they are alone or at night when they pass out from drug use. What's up, bro?
Please don't forget to subscribe, like, share, ring the bell and leave comments. Until next time, thank you so much.